How's everybody doing today? Back again with another video for you guys. And today, I got a pretty cool unboxing for you guys. But real quick, before I get started, just want to give y'all a little backstory here. So, this is another um, product brought to you by the Amazon Reviewers Club that I'm a part of. And a company called uh, Neck Trek. Neck Trek. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Sorry if I butchered it. But just wanted to get that out the way. So right here what we have for you guys today. Or what I have for you guys today. Is my unboxing and first impressions of the Neck Trek. Um, uh, Qualcomm Quick Charge 3.0 Certified. 10,050 milliamp hour power bank. Alright. So, now, in the interest of speed, I already ripped all the packages and ripped all the tape. And so this is just what you get after you take it out of the package. Now, this came via Amazon. As always, as you guys know, I have Amazon Prime. And this came pretty quickly. Now, there was a little delay because you know it's the holiday season. But it still got here within the time frame that they said it was going to get here. You know, it was a tad late, but it still came on the day that they said. So, good job, Amazon. But anyways, let's get into this box. So, just give y'all a quick round of the box here. I like how they have that set up. And you got some information on the back here. Yeah, that's pretty much it. No company branding on that side. No company branding on this side. Got your barcodes and FCC information. Yeah. Alright, so let's crack this box. Now, also in the interest of speed, so I can start using it right away, I cracked the box and I already fully charged it. Now, this particular one didn't come fully charged, but yours may. Alright, so here it is. Inside of the box here, up front, dead center here. Got the unit itself. Let me get this out of the box. Alright. Put this off to the side real quick. Let's see what else we got in here. We have the user manuals. Alright. Now, you guys know... In terms of smartphones and things of that nature, we don't really read user manuals. But, in my opinion, you should always be familiar with your user manuals. More so familiar when you picking up things like power banks and things of that nature. Because they have embedded batteries in them and you don't want to misuse the product and potentially damage it. So when it comes to power banks, headphones things of that nature, you should definitely read your user manual. Now, we're going to cover this a little bit. Let me throw this off the side. Let's see. Got a little thing here. Thank you for choosing Neck Trek. And let's see what's in here. Micro USB charging cables. So it's pretty cool that they included one. And I don't think we got anything else. Nope, that's it. Alright, so now let's throw this box off the side. Alright. And let's take a look at the user manual here. Alright. So it opens up like so. So, there we have it. We got a little diagram letting you know where everything is. Then we got um, uh, specifications. So it tells you... It, the dimensions, it tells you the weight, and it tells you the capacity. And it also tells you that it, the outputs. So you have two ports. Uh, looks like it says one at 5 volts at 2 amps, and a, another one, okay, with a max of 18 watts total. Alright, and then it does tell you down there in small print, let me let that focus, that this is Qualcomm Quick, Quick Charge Certified, if I could talk, sorry guys. Then, over here, it just tells you the, uh, the package contents, 
and how to charge the device and it also tells you how long it should take to charge now mine was not completely dead but still just for the heck of it I uh, charged it up full charge because I wanted to use it straight out of the box and yeah we're gonna we're gonna reserve judgment because I didn't use the regular cable I used my quick charger and it actually charged up pretty quickly but we're gonna fully get into that when I go over the full review of this guy all right and it's just saying you could charge it with um, any device that has a micro USB port and right here it's just letting you know what the LEDs mean so one blinking LED means it's um, less than 10% and you may need to charge it a solid LED means it's between between 25 and and 10 and 25 percent two LEDs means it's between uh, 25 percent and 50 percent and three LEDs means it's between 50 percent and 75 percent and all four LEDs on the device means that it's a, between 75 percent and 100 percent and again it's just telling you that it's Qualcomm quick charge certified and it's just giving you some warning information so certain things you don't want to do with this guy that may potentially damage it so that's pretty cool that they included that and last but not least here on this page we have contact information and support information so if at any point during the video I went too fast you guys can always pause and read all this stuff for yourself that's why I'm making sure that I get it in some nice crispy focus for you guys alright so that pretty much covers the user manual now I pretty I like how they did that got a nice clean layout user manual wasn't too big it's very simple it's very straightforward I like how they did that so let's throw this off to the side now first impressions of the unit here is it's got a little weight to it I, I'm liking the small form factor um, I actually have a, another power bank from Loomsing that's a little bit skinnier than this, but it's, it's less milliamps. It's a little bit skinnier than this, and that one fits nicely into my pocket with my smartphones. This one's a little bit smaller, but it's a little bit more chunky, but it should do the same thing. Alright, so I'm, I'm, liking, I'm liking the look of it. I'm liking the weight of it. It actually feels very hefty. You know, it reaffir reaffirms what they said about it being a 10,050 milliamp hour battery. You definitely could feel the weight like, like it's definitely something hefty in here. So that's pretty cool. Now right here, we have our two charging ports. And you can see one of them is clearly labeled as Qualcomm's Quick Charge. And then this one, it looks like it has a auto detect. So this one should auto detect the best rate to charge your device and charge your device at the best rate possible then we got our micro USB in to charge the device now you can use any micro USB cable but in the interest of safety if you don't have um, quality cables it's probably best just to use the cables that came with the device here but I have some nice quality cables so that's not going to be an issue then we have our power button, which pretty much you just click it once, and it turns on the LEDs, and these are some bright LEDs, guys, and you can see that it is fully charged there. Alright, then on this side, we just got some Qualcomm Quick Charge Brandon right here, let that focus, and then, where was it, I saw it earlier, alright, it's over here. So, now we just have some more specifications of the device. So I don't know how well that's going to focus. There we go. So you can see it's telling you it has smart output technology in it. And it's telling you the wattage and the voltage. And it's telling you the capacity and the model number. So there you guys go. Alright. So pretty much that was my unboxing and first impressions of the Neck Trek 10,050 milliamp hour uh, power bank. 
Now, I don't think this one should take too long to review. It should take me about a week or so to review. So you guys stay tuned to the channel for my full review. And we're going to go ahead and talk about everything. Because I really want you guys to know if you really are getting your money's worth. So similar to the Loomsing Power Bank. Similar to the, the Zero Lemon Power Bank. We're going to go through and talk about everything. And see if this guy is really up to snuff. Alright. <clears throat> now. If you guys enjoyed the video, please help your boy out and uh, give the video a thumbs up. That really does help me out. You don't know how much. If you want to see more raw, uncut content like this, because I never really know what's going to happen when I push record, please hit the subscribe button down below so you get notified as soon as I post new videos to YouTube. And just to make sure you get those notifications, go ahead and click that little bell and it'll give you a notification letting you know that you will get notified when I post a video to YouTube. Um, don't forget guys, all the links to where to purchase this guy at a really good price it will be located down in the video description. And as always, if you know anyone out there looking for some high quality performance devices and products at some really great prices, please share with them my channel because I'm doing this for everyone because we all deserve the best. Alright guys, I will catch y'all in my next video and I hope everyone has a great day. Peace.